What's up, YouTube? It's Ken Sai, and I am back with another video. Me and my friends just left the mall, and I got home into stuff. I also been ordering a lot from Shein, um, so I decided I was gonna do a little last minute um, trying to haul for you guys. I have not been active, I have not been uploading, I have not been doing what I said I was gonna do. My New Year's resolution was actually to upload at least three videos each month. I have not uploaded a video since I believe January. I uploaded three videos in January, and after that I've been slacking. Um, College ain't no joke. So balancing school and YouTube is something that I have not gotten used to yet. But I'm gonna get into that um in later videos. But right now I'm gonna give y'all a try and haul. I got stuff from Shein, H&M, Rule 21. Hmm. Charlotte Rue, Rue 21. Um, I think that's it. But if that is not it, I even got some stuff from Walmart. Y'all sleeping on Walmart, but I'm bored. I'm actually really sleepy because I've been, I went to class this morning and I went to the mall today. Um, I went to our mail room to get my packages from Sheen. So yeah, I'm going to give you all a little try on haul. I just hope this stuff fits, but let's get into this video. Because this try on haul was not planned, I do not know any of the information for the stuff that is from Sheen, but I do know that this outfit was like one size only. So I've been working out a lot, so I was like, I'm gonna buy some workout outfits. I got on Fabletics and no. <laughs> so, um, then I was like, do she know workout outfits? And to my surprise, they definitely did. They were definitely more affordable than anything on Fabletics and Amazon and whatever. So I got this. It was really hard to get into. You got one size really means like extra small to maybe a really tiny medium. Cause this shirt, it has like booby pads in it, but um, it was hard to get into. That's what I'm saying. The shorts actually are really comfortable, and like the band right here is like fitted, so it makes your stomach look flat. Because at first I put it up, up here like this, and then my stomach started moving out a little bit. But then when I pulled this down, my stomach instantly just got flatter. I know y'all seen the difference when I just did that, but um. I'm back up can you see me oh y'all can see me because yeah yeah but i've been working out and i bought me a sweet sweat moisture on amazon and i got the little um sweating cream that came with it they sent the sample with the moisture but i'm gonna order some more of that stuff because it works it works you're gonna Get your bodies in shape. I really started working out because I read that it helps with like mental health and like depression and stuff like that. And in college, you will be stressed out and that will mess with your mental. So I recommend working out exercise. Like that's a really good stress reliever and everything else. And that'll build your confidence. Like get your body together. You will stop thinking about these little girls, these little fast tail, these men out here that ain't. Yeah, like y'all will not care no more. Once you start getting your body right, get your mind right, all that, like, yeah. This is really cute, I like this. Um, I'm gonna insert the price. Cause yeah, but I'm gonna wear this as a regular outfit, as a workout outfit. Cause yeah, cause yeah, cause yeah, cause yeah. Very comfortable, hard to get into. They should have made this like small, medium, large. Uh, they shouldn't have made it one size because that one size stuff will really get you. Um, I know that I was gonna be able to fit it, but the top was hard to get into. That's all I'm saying. That's all I'm saying. Next outfit, next outfit, next outfit, next outfit, next outfit, next outfit. This outfit is in a size small, and I'm already about to tell y'all like I'm irritated because. First of all, I always get smalls when it's a two-piece set because I'm small on the top. And I'd rather have two tight pants 
that fit but are just too tight rather than a too big top that I can't really wear because like if this was too big like what the what like how am I gonna work out in this like but this is still too big at the top for real for real like I have a lot of space and it's like I'm running like I don't feel like I don't know okay. but the pants tight as hell could barely get the pants up like that tight like jump in to put them on and stuff but my favorite color is orange. Just came my soulmates on this video and wanted to know my favorite color is orange bay, okay? You got a little crisscross in the back. But it makes my butt look flat. I don't know if that's because like I needed a medium um in these leggings, but I don't like how I make my body look. I feel like I got a mom body, which is not a bad thing at all. But I'm not a mom. Ain't had a key. Like, ain't even did to do. So, therefore, I shouldn't look like this. Um, I feel like it make my stomach appear bigger. Um, and my butt smaller. But I read in the comments on, like, in the reviews for this outfit, that it made your butt look good. Like, that it did wonders. This is a workout outfit. I should feel comfortable. I should feel a little bit confident in it. Like, I should be able to go out and run in this. But this doesn't have a lot of support. Like, this part, not really budget. I don't really want it to be tight, but like, I don't know. It's not loose, but it's not tight. That's what I mean. But y'all know what I mean. The color is cute. I just really don't like this on me. Like, I probably. Cause I feel like these outfits should be versatile. Like I should be able to throw on a jean jacket with this and it'd be cute. Like me be able to wear this out. But I don't feel like I would do that. Like this outfit would like strictly be for working out and that's it. And that's a disappointment. But this has padding in it. I think it said like 10% spandex and 90% something else nylon or something. Maybe like, yeah, I don't know. But I'm gonna put all this stuff on the screen for these outfits. Cause yeah, I got this from Sheen. If you didn't already know, got this from Sheen. Booty on flat, flat. Stomach on fat, fat. But that's okay. Anyways, go to the next topic. Okay, so Sheen. Sheen, you snapped with this outfit. This outfit is made out of the same stuff, but it feels so much softer. It has booby pads again, you know. I need that. Um, this is a size small. Let me tell you why they snapped. Let me tell you why they snapped. Do you see the butt? Zoom in on the butt. This seems a little bit inappropriate for YouTube, but I know y'all see that. They put a seam going up the butt to make your butt look bigger. Y'all snap. Hold on. And then, it's the same size as the other one, but this one is more comfortable. This one is more comfortable. Like, I wear this out on a regular day. I wear this to work out, I wear this anywhere. Even though the butt is a little bit inappropriate, but it looks good. It looks good. And what other reason do you buy clothes other than to look good and to feel good? I look good and I feel good. That orange one disappointed me, no. Um, but this one, no, I'm just playing, but you like, I don't know. I don't know. This made me wanna go to my kiss, go to my kiss, go to my oh, oh. well, well, well. One thing about doing these trial hauls for y'all is it is prank as hell on my end because it is dead silent in this room like it is dead silent i can't listen to music because of copyright issues like so i have to be my own entertainment while entertaining you guys so well lucky i love y'all that's y'all lucky y'all lucky next outfit they snapped it's not your beauty, it's your booty. And they snapped. Wait, because I think he said it's not your beauty, it's your booty. And they snapped. I had to redo it because I think I said it wrong. And I didn't want to say it wrong because y'all can cover me. 
in the comments, like y'all always do. Just hit myself, no, it's okay. And if y'all like my hair, my sweet man did them. She's not, for sure. She's not, for sure. Because these ain't them little crochet. These ain't them, these ain't them. They look normal crochet. If you guys have them right now, don't feel bad. I used to wear those. But she's not with these. These that. These are them. So, get with her, book with her, period. Okay, so I guess the lighting is gonna keep changing based on like what color I'm wearing because I look really like I'm in dark right now, but I'm not. But this is like a bando top, I guess. I got this from Charlotte Ruth. Um, it was like six dollars. These were on sale because the price tag says eleven ninety nine, but they were six dollars. I have two. I got one in red and I got this one. I like these. I got a lot of backlit stuff to show my new tattoo. But I think this is cute. It's getting hot outside. I'm going to Florida in a little bit, so I think this may or may not be one of the tops that I wear there. No, I don't have no boobs. Yes, I'm part of the ADB committee. No, I don't care. Please don't comment nothing about me. We don't do no body shaving around these parts. Um, but yes. So this is the first one. I'm gonna put on the other one just so y'all can see like the color switch up. So this is how the red one looks. I really like the material. Oh, I got these in a extra small slash small. Um, I know I didn't have no boobs, so medium just wasn't gonna do it for me. I like stuff like this to be tight fitted just because, um, if it was loose, it was gonna be falling all over the place. But yeah, I really like the like material is stretchy. This is a part of their streetwear society collection. I don't know if you guys keep up with that type of stuff, but yeah, these are really cute. I like these. Get into it. Don't look at my nails either. Every time I get on here, my nails are messed up. I don't know what's going on, but you all never see me when I got a first set. I don't know. <laughs> I don't know. Now, I also got this top from Charlotte Bruce. This was $6. They have like a really good sale. I don't know. But yeah, I like these. I already told you I got a back tattoo a couple months ago. So it's healed up now and it's really cute and I want to show it off. So I got this. Too bad my hair blocking it because y'all don't see this tattoo. This little it hurt it, okay? But I got these pants from Walmart. Let me, y'all could kind of see me in my mirror. These make your butt look big, like big. I'm gonna show you all from a different angle. The pants are size small. Y'all better stop sleeping on Walmart. And they like the like the soft, like stretchy material. So if y'all must me get your stuff from Walmart, the eight dollars. I don't be telling like my information on here as far as like sizing. So I'm pretty sure I'm like five, five and a half, and I was somewhere in the 130, 130s possibly. So if that's like if y'all needed that for reference. But let's go to the next outfit. I got this shirt um, from Rue 21. Nine times out of 10, I'm gonna wear it as like a t-shirt dress with some fishnets and stuff like that. I hope y'all can't see my booty in the mirror because, um, yeah. But <laughs> I'm gonna put my caption as anything for Kayla. I get it, no? Yeah, like anything for Selena. Anyways. This is really cute. This is an extra large though. The normal price is like $19.99, $20 basically. But they have a sale going on. Buy one, get one, 50% off. So I don't know if this one's 50% off or the other one I'm about to show y'all. But either way, can y'all see like the link? Let me put my crack on. Look, if I stand the way back here, can y'all see? But you, like, if you wear stuff like this, you should really put on, like, spandex or some type of shorts or maybe even pants. I don't really wear big shirts and then baggy pants. I've tried the trend, and it really don't look that good on me. 
but I'm gonna show you my next outfit because my next outfit is like kind of going with that trend. And I don't know, but yeah, Rule 21, size extra large, $20.899 if you get the bottom one. Get one 50% off. But this is the other shirt that I got. I'm pretty sure they made this one half up because this one was $16.99. You know, they always be trying to be funny and make the one that was less expensive, the one that's half off. So, you know, I think this one was $8.99. It ended up being $8.99. But it has Marilyn Monroe on it. I thought it was cute. And I left these pants here. <laughs> um, I left these here when I really should have took them to the mall with me to, like, match the colors. But the colors, like, match kind of but this is a trend where the pants is baggy and you got the oversized shirt and then sometimes people put the turtleneck underneath and stuff i only think it look good on me because i don't really have a lot of curves to my body like i'm kind of like a stick so um this trend don't really look good like it's not really bringing to my body type, or in my opinion at least like if this was a crop top and then I have some baggy pants. You can see my little butt a little bit. So then maybe, but I don't know. It's cool, I guess. I didn't tie the strings and I didn't make them like as tight as they could be. But I want y'all to see like the cargo effect. So I'm gonna zoom in on these. They were a large. I got these from Charlotte Rose. But originally they were $30. But I think I got them for like $15. Because they was having a sale. Y'all better get there. Like, we don't have Charlotte Rose in my city anymore. I think, I'm pretty sure they took it out of our mall. But here they have it. And all that stuff be on sale. All the time. Go in there. Find cute stuff. Like, so yeah. This is a dress that I got from H&M today, and it is so cute. I mean, look at the price for my butter, though. Actually, I think it was like $13. It was $13. But it was, that was like the full price. Um, But they have me sign up for this rewards thing because I'm in there so much. This is how the body looks. Yes, I am giving you body okay miss ma'am yes yes <laughs> yes because the hair be it's giving it's giving period okay Very much giving. Very much. I'm finna wear this tomorrow. No, I'm just playing. I'm going home tomorrow. Um, but next nice day outside, it's giving. So, yeah. Y'all better get into it. It's the body for me, babe. Yeah. Maybe it's the color, because I don't really wear bright colors like this. It's not as short as this. This is a small. They had an extra small, and I was like, is that gonna be too tight? Like, am I gonna be able to breathe in that? And I want to stretch it, but then I have no stretch. This one has a lot of stretch, so I don't know what's up with that, but this is cute. Expect it to be this cute one, like H and M, H and M. You knew what you were doing. You knew what you were doing. Hot girl summer. Okay, okay. Look at it. I wish I had a little bit of like support. So I wish it was like this. Does that make my chest look flatter, don't it? Anyways, it's giving. Let's try the next. This shirt is giving. Mm, mm, mm. And the boom, 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 boom. If 
y'all know that movie comment with that what scene that is from what movie i hope y'all know that movie because i am not that old like y'all better know that movie it's from honey what's her name missy elliott did that shit she's like what is this 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 and boom, 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 boom. no but anyways this shirt is from Shane. size extra small for my itty bitty committee and it looked like i kind of got a booty yeah because period but anyways i do have one complaint what are all these strings ings 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 in the boom 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 like i'm gonna have to cut them and i'm scared the shirt is gonna start unraveling and the bottom got them too like it's not a part of the style or did the factory just make a mistake but anyways this one of them shirts that's gonna show my back i'm sad though because i feel like i'm gonna keep these locks in and just get them redone for my trip so nobody's gonna see my back Anyways, shirt, 10 out of 10. It's just the strings for me. I'm glad I ordered this size because I feel like a small would have been too big because even though this is an extra small, it's still loose, like loose as hell. So yeah, this is cute. I'm gonna have to tuck the strings back in because I look scared of But the jeans I have one are also from Sheen. They are a size small. On Sheen, it would probably say size four. Um, They fit almost perfect one small problem my waist is smaller than this waist so i have a lot of room but you can't really tell um they don't really do much for my butt because they're not like fitted, but they're really cute on um, i'm about to have to change the angle of the camera and i'll be right back with you guys Can y'all see how they look from back here? Like, I don't really have a butt in these, but they're cute or whatever. Maybe I just don't have a butt in general. Maybe that's the problem. Maybe I just don't have a butt. I'm irritated because these don't really fit, but they have like a really um, nice design. I like the rips on the back. They were hard to get into because there's rips on the front and on the back. But once I got them on, I realized they were like low key getting really tight at the thighs and they weren't really trying to pull up. That's when I knew they didn't fit. I really don't have a butt in them. And then this part has a little swoop right there. That's when you know it's too small. Like I can't even. And then my little thigh meat back here busting out. Um, no. Basically, these jeans don't fit and they're really hard to get into. And I'm in the because I really like these. <laughs> they're not high waisted, if y'all can see in the mirror. They're really low and they just don't do anything for me. But they were extremely tight to get on and that's how I know they're too small. These are a small though. The other jeans basically fit perfectly. So I don't know why these are small as well and they are just too tight. Um, But they're cute they just don't fit like i can only wear this probably in like a graphic tee that's gonna come down here and cover the little swoop where my coochie is because otherwise these ain't gonna work um they're cute though i really like them i wish i would have got a bigger size but who would have knew i get smaller knees jeans and they fit and then i get smaller knees ones and they don't fit so she and you need to work on your sizing because I'm annoyed. Um, this shirt though, I think it's so small, extra small. I didn't look at the tag. I don't even know if it had them on there. But it has this really cute tie up thing in the back. See, the jeans look so cute back though. But my butt is flat and tight and then the strings hang down. I'm getting on top of it. I keep talking about the jeans and we on the shirt now. But I just like this. I have some brown first lines that I'm probably going to wear with this when I go on my trip. But I just like, I've been feeling new 
nude and like neutral tone stuff. So yeah, that's why I got this. But I thought it was a little bit darker on the lips. I'm not gonna lie. But uh, these jeans are really just making me feel really, cause I don't have no hips in them. <laughs> Barely got a butt in them. They not high waisted, so I can't pull them up here to cover up my tummy. Like I'm finna say, no, cause I just feel some kind of way. They're not doing my body justice. But I was trying to zone. I was like, crap the curve, crap the curve, crap the curve, crap the curve. I was trying to get them up. And then they made me think of, don't jump up my jeans on my pain, don't feel my pain. Or whatever um, Beyonce said. But yeah, shirt, pants. I mean, you said it. I just should have worn a size up. Let's go to the next shirt if I get you to because I really want to see the head. I really want to see the head. Uh, This really cute top from H&M. It was like $10. It's a size small. Um, it doesn't really do anything for my boobs, but I think it's really cute. Um, it has that kind of like, that type of print on it. Don't look at my nose. Do not look at my nose. That's not even funny. Why are you looking? These jeans is mad tight. Yo. Oh my goodness. I'm gonna take these off. But, I bought this purse from Sheen. has a real weird situation going on um, to match the print. All this stuff has like a smell because you see like the print matches. I really did that. I didn't think I have a dress for long, but I really did that. So it came with this little chain so you could probably hook the chain on the side and it came with another one. Am I the only one to be scared like when we get stuff from the factory that something will come crawling out like that was in the factory? Or is that just me? Like, I don't know, what is this like, spider in here? I gotta shake this thing. You know, this is cute though. I'm about to put the little cookie things on, the little chains and stuff on. Be right back. This one doesn't reach all the way around, so really you would have to carry like that these pull clothes i don't know it's just different i don't see people walking around with these kind of purses i do have a complaint because what is that don't look at my nails please you what is that what is that dark mark right there then the strings look dirty like they look dingy um and there's little flecks of like cardboard or like pieces of wood like i don't know what that is but do better shane they be blowing me because like some of that stuff be real cute and comfy and perfect and clean and smelling good and whatnot not without a smell oh that's the bottom um and then with this stuff it just be like they be half doing it so do better because i'm not even gonna use this little chain because i I feel like they kind of look stupid just hanging on the side like that. I don't know. Y'all might like that, but I don't really like that. I thought it was going to be cute, but it's not even big enough to carry like this. Like, it's not long enough, I mean. Like, kind of. It kind of. Kind of, barely. Mm. It's cute, though. Like, this is going to be a cute outfit. I also got another purse, so I'm gonna open that one up. I'm gonna just stand up close because my own um, lighting don't keep. Okay, they might have did something with this one. They might have did something with this one. I wanted it big enough to where I could fit like my wallet in it if I wanted to do that. And like, um, just, you know, zip cross, like all that. I'm probably not going to use that gold chain. Because I really just wanted a small white purse that I could wear with a lot of stuff. I really need a black one too. But this is really cute. The chain hooks on to the side. Just like the other one. My hair be doing what I want to do so at this point we're going to leave it alone but 
I'm looking crazy, y'all. Just leave it at that. Just don't even mind it, cause I didn't look worse on YouTube. Y'all done seen me here crying the whole week. Cause I'm gonna set me free. I'm gonna send around. This plastic on here, um, I'm black. The plastic on here, I would need to cut off, and I'm not saying look for no scissors and cut it off. Y'all see the purse? I like the purse. Like, this is what it looks like. It's giving very much. It's one of those. I'm be on Instagram Live. But that pretty much wraps up my video. I'm gonna put my jacket on just cause it's cold in here. Now I'm gonna try to feel like I'm um, wearing this out because I ain't got to work yet. I ain't get to work. I'm gonna basically explain why I haven't been uploading for real and then I'm going to wrap up this video. If you guys don't wanna hear this part, go ahead and click off cause the trial mall is over. I am done. So, Basically, a couple months ago, probably in December, maybe early January, I recorded a um, little confessional about like my past relationships, my little depression phase and stuff like that, things that I was going through that was keeping me from being happy and uploading as much as I would like to and things like that. Um, the video ended up being about three, four hours long. So I was like, I'm gonna have to split this into two parts. The first part is still like an hour long. Um, haven't even got to the second part yet. Cause I don't know what I'm doing. Like a bit off more than I could chew because I record and edit off my phone. So um, that's where I'm at right now. I stopped editing it a couple months ago because I was just like done with it. I started recording mukbangs with my friends here. Um, I start doing like little makeup videos with people doing voiceovers for me, stuff like that for you guys. Um, the person that was doing the voiceovers is flaky, so can't do that. The mukbangs I was doing with my friends here, there's an op in one of the videos, so can't upload that, like, cause I'm not gonna let it op get clout off of me. And yeah, so that's where I'm at. Um, I'm gonna keep trying to upload for you guys. Hopefully this gets up um, soon. It is the beginning of April. I'm not gonna say what day because you guys are gonna shame me if um it doesn't get uploaded within this month but that's where i'm at with the videos i don't really and then the emotional video that was about my personal business and all that that's really long um it's risky so i was asking people like should i really upload this like a lot of people don't know like the situation or how i was feeling and i'm kind of just airing myself out and they were like yeah like that's what you do with your subscribers you air yourself out but I'm a really private person. I don't really like to talk a lot. I'm really quiet, I'm shy, and I don't like people in my business. You know, my business don't do that. Like, um, so that's why the video hasn't gotten uploaded yet. I'm still like, should I even upload this? Like, is this what people want to see? So comment down below if you guys would like to see that. Um, if not, that's fine. But I'm probably gonna upload it anyways, just like not right now. Um, probably should have uploaded it when I first recorded it, so then I wouldn't have been able to like back out of it. It would have been up by now, and I would have been uploading consistently. But I overthought it, like I overthink everything, and yeah. But we're back at it, so hopefully I am consistent from this point forward. If y'all like these try hauls, y'all need to let me know, cause I will keep doing them if you guys like them. If y'all don't, then. I will not keep doing them because this definitely took me like two hours. <laughs> um, yeah. So, you know what to do. You know what to do when the kids run. Boom, boom. You know what to do. 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 You guys enjoy the rest of your day, whatever you're doing, wherever you're at. Um, just know somebody out there loves you. possibility you right there hey you
it just click on this camera. No, I'm just playing. If you like this video, give it a thumbs up. Don't forget to like, comment, subscribe, share my videos, share my videos with your friends. What that like some of that. Yeah. Don't forget to hit that bell so you can be notified whenever I upload a video. Okay? <laughs>